NBA playoffs have arrived as we kick it off with Game 1 in the East, right here on EA Sports. From American Airlines Arena in South Florida, tonight, the Miami Heat taking on the Orlando Magic. Hi again, everyone. Ed Cohen with my partner, Jay Williams. Jay, you look at the Heat con into play. They have got to get home court advantage, and they'll need it in what's going to be a tight five-game series. And I'll tell you, these five games really make each game take on a greater importance than the seven-game series we're used to. The Orlando Magic control the tap. To Gordon. And he knocks it down. Jay, as key a move as you'll find in the NBA. And it is the new age triple threat. It does two things. Number one, it creates distance in a hurry. Number two, when you're stepping east to west while maintaining your dribble, which is the difference maker, it throws a defender off because now he's at your mercy and he's off balance. And it just may be, Jay, the biggest threat late in the shot clock. If you, especially if you add a hesitation to the move or if you look at the rim, you'll most time have the defender jumping out of his shoes. We wish defenders all the best in this game defending that. He's not known for that. Markel Fultz, the former number one pick, hits a tough shot. Every hero needs a good sidekick. Nice find to set up a three. Yes, and the foul. And a chance at three coming up. That was such a great job by the offensive player. Knowing that you're probably going to take some lumps here and there, but still remaining aggressive throughout the shot and getting a crack at the extra point. Free throw's good. It's a three-point play, and we're even at five. Fultz into the front court. He'll run the offense. Goes reverse to lay it in. In the paint, you need to finish just like that. Aaron Gordon swats it. Ugh. That's why a rim protector is a necessity in this game. Fultz with the basketball. Two-point advantage to Aaron Gordon. Bam, out of bio. Able to recover with the block. He'd have the basketball. Tough-looking shot there. Still gets it to go down. And that is the sign of an unselfish team. When everybody in transition thinks they have a chance to get the ball because you have a willing passer, somebody willing to make other players on his team look great, that's only going to force your players to play that much harder on offense and give you more energy on the defensive end to Gordon. Slam dunk for Jonathan Isaac. You never want to leave anything to chance when you attack the rim. You finish strong every time you head home. Aaron Gordon with a piece. That kid can block out the sun, Ed. Fultz into the front court. Leads a bucket. From the outside, no good. And you have to remember that your hand is part of the ball. There wasn't enough contact on that play for the rest to blow the whistle. Coach of the Magic will use a timeout as he'll talk things over here in the first quarter. We have both squads set to make some moves right now. Kel Fultz, two for three now here in the first. No doubt about where that one was headed. The crossover gets inside and the slam dunk. Jay, this is getting scary fast. If you're the defense, you have to deny him the ball. Maybe throw a box in one, maybe throw a zone, maybe even throw the kitchen sink because he's putting on a show in the first quarter. To Fultz. Uh, 
now ready for a couple of free throws. It's still early, so no real impact on that call. But you know that they're going to call this one tight, so you might want to keep your hands out of his pocket. Rondé Hollis Jefferson, a couple of free throws on the way. For his career, 76% from the line. And hits the first free throw. And fails to hit them both. Hits the first, misses the second. Converts in the paint. Nice finish at the rim. When the ball's in his hands, we all knew what was going to happen. Fultz with the basketball. Shot clock off as they look for a go-ahead bucket. Down a point. Takes it right to the rim. A lot of contact there, but they say no foul. Oh, highlight moves. Tough to do with the defender all over you. Fultz there for the rebound. We've reached the end of the first quarter here in game one. Jay and I are back after this. It's the NBA playoffs on EA Sports. One quarter in the books, and Jay, naturally, both coaches wanted to get more stops. But boy, was that fun to watch. If anything, on this game, Ed, you have to expect the unexpected. When players have range that extend outside the gymnasium, oh, we're going to get a chance to watch something special. Free throw up and good. Gives him a two-point lead. Fultz into the front court. Looking to make something happen. Isaac to Fultz. Jonathan Isaac sends it away. That ball's out of bounds. Last touch by a Magic. He gets it. You normally don't see that, but that's the type of thing that keeps shooters in the league for a long time. Every once in a while, they venture into the paint. Markel Fultz to Mo Bamba. Oh, the heat right there to take it away. Come on, let's dig in. Let's really build this lead. Finishing inside the paint on that one. Attack mode isn't a switch that you can just turn on and off. You need to do more of that. We need to see him penetrate, get into that lane, and create. Fultz to Mo Bamba. To Aaron Gordon. The Magic with four to shoot. Bam, out of bio with the block. Sent a message on that one, Ed. Nice finish at the rim. He's been doing this for years. The physicality in which he plays. No one wants to see that. You're going to leave the game with black and blue marks all over your body. Now the Magic going to signal for a timeout as they'll talk things over here in the second quarter.
pressures coming from both sides right now. Markel Fultz to Mo Bamba. Able to convert inside. Old school equals high percentage. I got ball, I got ball. Pick up, pick up, match up, match up. Stuffs it down with authority. I know there's that old saying that says one man can't beat five, but we're watching one man carry four other players. His back has to be hurting. Another big time finish. And he's fouled. Couple of free throws coming up, Jay. Smart play to rip through the extended arm of the defender. That will get you to the free throw line every time. Markel Fultz. He's got two shots coming. A career 47% free throw shooter. And he connects on the first free throw. Coming right back to you. Gets both to drop at the line. Count the basket at the rim. Man, that may not have been a gimme, but that layup at the rim definitely chips away at the pride of the defense. Magic Cabin. Fultz. Terrific vision. From the painted area, won't go down. Yo, big kudos to the defender. It seems like the mere presence of him in the paint was enough to throw off the concentration of the guy trying to drop the layup in. Oh, denied! As my old teammate RJ would say, stay down, clown. Screen coming. Trying to cash in, just not going down. Basket's good on the follow. Way to stay with it. And sometimes less is more. Keeping it simple is the best way. Stuffs it down with authority. It's easy to become mesmerized when you watch a player who can create off the dribble. We call that dancing. When you allow a player to dance with that much space, that's prob city. Markel Fultz to Mo Bamba. Knocked loose. And that's going to get out of bounds. So it stays with Orlando. Fultz. Shot from the lane won't go. Leaving no doubt. Slams it down. Mm -hmm. We call that get your money and put it in the bank. <laughs> Fultz with the basketball. Less than a minute to go in this third quarter. Cleaning the offensive glass. To Mo Bamba. Nice pass to set things up. The one thing we know for certain in this league, it doesn't matter how big the margin is, you can always put together a run and get back in this one. Stuffs it down with authority. It can only be one of two things here. One, the defender ran out of gas. Or two, this dude is just unstoppable. To Mo Bamba. Knocked loose. And that's going to get out of bounds. So it stays with the magic. Markel Fultz. I got this play on. Let's go. Dies for it. Not afraid to mix it up. I got you. I got you. Don't worry. Get him up. Get him up. Get him up. Lays it up and in. Hey, one of the things I hear all the great teams say in the huddle, they say one, two, three, no mercy. Now it's time for you to go even harder on the defensive end. Got it. Nothing going here on that drive. He'll put it up. At the buzzer, three quarters complete as the Heat enjoy some breathing room. It's bad.
Magic Basketball here as we start the fourth quarter. They're looking up at a big margin. And that, Jay, shouldn't come as a surprise to many. Well, for them to have a chance to win, I'm glad they brought their A game in their backpacks here to the arena, but that's not enough. They need their A-plus game, and they need to execute down the stretch. You need to throw everything in the bag at them in order to win this game. Nothing going here on that drive. Fultz into the front court. 14-point deficit. To Hollis Jefferson. Gets a shot up off the mark. Rondé Hollis Jefferson rejects it. Out of bounds the call. Last touch by Terrence Ross. Mixing things up. Hockey line substitutions. Both teams making changes. And now... Fultz to Hollis Jefferson. Can't connect to Fultz. Five to shoot for Orlando. Beyond the arc for three. He's been waiting a long time for that one to go down. As a shooter, your hands always have to be ready. Ready, meaning that your hands are always... Stuffs it down with authority. Jay, that's been the story this evening. I mean, another one? Another dunk? Another easy possession? I mean, how demoralizing can this be for the team? Why am I the only one yelling? I don't see anybody on the bench yelling. I don't see anybody on the court even angry right now. It goes down. Uh, I'm not sure that wasn't an offensive foul, but take it when you can get it. Drive on the baseline, but his shot stays out. And you see so many players quit on the play after they were beat the first time, but not him. He stayed on his hip, he fought back, and he made the player miss the shot. That's great defense. Miami secures the rebound. A lot of contact on that play. He plays through it and scores. You know, it reminds me out of a story a legendary coach once told me. He said, if you ever get in a fight, you're not going to hit somebody with an open hand, correct? You'll probably break a finger. But if you hit somebody with a fist, what is that? That's five fingers working collectively together as one. That's how you deliver a knockout punch, and that's what we're seeing tonight. Has a chance. Magic habit. To Hollis Jefferson. And the reward is going to the line. You never really want to foul a shooter, but if you do, ensure they're going to have a tough time converting. That's good knowledge of personnel. Rondé Hollis Jefferson at the line for two shots. Shooting 50%. Some yes, some no in this contest. Knocks down the first. Goes two for two at the line. Wait on. Here I come. Here I come. Hey. Roll take, roll take. Missed it. He always has the green light, but the defense was ready. That's how you do it. You keep riding him to the basket, and if the refs aren't calling it, keep being physical. Keep knocking him off balance. Slam dunk for Hollis Jefferson. Over, gets inside, and the slam dunk. Late heave to beat the buzzer. The Heat with the victory. They grabbed game one of this best of five series. For my partner Jay Williams and our entire crew, I'm Ed Cohen. This has been the NBA Playoffs on EA Sports. Find out more at easports.com. The Heat were solid in today's victory. They were very opportunistic on defense, and it earned them a bunch of steals. Those first turnovers made all of the difference.
check out the leading scores for the